With age comes wisdom, but also some aches and pains. If you're having back or joint pain, your primary care provider might refer you to a sports medicine physician. Dr. Reginald Pinder tells us why sports medicine isn't just for athletes. Good morning, Dr. Pinder. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So it has aspects of family medicine, emergency medicine, orthopedics, as well as physical medicine and rehabilitation. What we do is really provide non-operative orthopedic care for all of our patients. Let's take a look at this knee. Patients are seeking non-surgical options for their more serious aches and pains. So non-operative orthopedics revolves around taking care of those same musculoskeletal injuries, so pain involving muscles, tendons, ligaments, and bones, but without doing any sort of a surgical approach. For patients who might not be ready to consider surgery, or for those who aren't surgical candidates, non-operative options are available to help alleviate pain, improve functioning, and enjoy better quality of life. The non-operative treatments are very successful, but in terms of doing, again, osteopathic medicine, targeted physical therapy, or a home exercise program, um, ultrasound-guided injections, there is level one evidence to prove the efficacy versus going to surgery in some instances. In fact, according to findings by the British Medical Association, for six of the 10 most common elective orthopedic procedures, evidence showed no benefit of surgery over non-operative care. The benefits about doing the non-operative approach is that you're gonna have a faster recovery still be able to get back out to doing those activities of daily living that you enjoy faster than if you were to have a surgical treatment. For Inspiration Health, I'm Liza Fernandez.